she has a harmonic balancer here's the key way and mine looks like Slightly wallered out. So, what do you do? What do you do when you're getting to that point? You replace your crankshaft, obviously, because the crankshaft pretty much looks just as bad. Or you make a tool. And drill and you drill the crankshaft and I can you guys see inside there So that's what I'm doing. Made a jig. This thing right here. And grind it down to size to fit inside the snout. Which that was a trick in itself. Getting this to grind it without machine to machine it. There's my first try, so it got crooked. So at the beginning. And to get this machine down to the correct size was not <laughs> easy. What I did, I took this, I took this thing. Let's cook with this thing here. And we shoved it in here. And then I use my bench grinder as this thing rotated. It allowed it to rotate. And use my bench grinder to grind it pretty pretty fucking round, I'll tell you that. Worked great because it was spinning. It wasn't stagnant in one place. Ground it fucking nicely. But who cares if it came out? Now I don't have to replace the crankshaft. Hopefully I don't. I'm not done yet. I'm just doing it. So I don't know if see inside there yet or what. Yep, seems to be working. I'm gonna do another hole opposite of that one. Dalp in it, and that's what I'm happening. I'm, I'm very pleased, because I was thought I was gonna have to replace the crankshaft. I still may have to, but I'm gonna see how this thing works out, and I'll keep everybody posted, but holy crap. Yeah, when I took, um, see the power steering pump was down underneath the um, anti-sway bar, when I put it in, so I had to remove the pulley so I could get the power steering pump up and the fucking harmonic balancer fell off. And I'm like, what the hell? And it was wallered, wallered out bad. I mean, how bad that is compared to 
what it should look like. And it does look like. Yikes. Yeah. Fucking. Woo. Lucky it didn't come off. All right. Have fun, everybody.